Hello, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make an interactive map with no code. A great example is what I started to build here. I started to build a map directory of the private and public prisons in the US. So I just have a few entries here. You see, you click on it, you can see information on it. It takes you directly to that entry on the map. If we scroll out, we can also see and click. We can scroll in to Alabama and, and click and see. So there's interesting things you can do here. You can make a directory of your community. You can make lots of interesting directories with this free no-code tool. The no-code tool we're going to use is no-code map app. And it has an amazing founder, it's an amazing concept, and very, very simple and easy to use. How we actually create the locations is using Google Sheets. And in Google Sheets, all you had to do, I downloaded the, the, the sheet template with sample data, and I just changed the sample data. You can add the name, address, description. And I've added two filter types. I've added a, a state filter. It says business type, but I added a state filter. Let me just change that to state. And let me just change this to type. We have an image link here. I didn't add a website. So we're going to go ahead and create something like this. So to start, we're going to, I'm going to sign in or you log in. You're going to create a new map. And what you have right here is a blank map. So you want to create it from the template first. You can either do general or timeline. Um, more templates should be coming soon. I did the general. And then you're going to apply the template. And it gives you sample data to begin with. So we're just going to let that generate. Okay, so that's generated and we have sample data. As you can see on this one, it has a call to action. That's because on ours, we just completely removed that call to action, which is where website is. What we're going to do, you can sync for Google Sheet later on. Um, I believe that's a filter that's coming a little bit later, but you can copy and paste from, Google, from a spreadsheet. So what you actually do is you just copy the entries and paste it here and you can either overwrite the current, current data or merge the current data. Um, just to show you what I did, I downloaded the example. So that should download. We have the general template. I went to Google Sheets, so I'm actually going to create a new spreadsheet. And what I'm going to do is call this spreadsheet no code map tutorial and I'm actually just to show you the my exact process I'm going to import this template that I just downloaded I'm not going to create a new spreadsheet I'm gonna replace spreadsheet and it doesn't matter because it's blank so let's replace the spreadsheet and as you can see, it looks very, very similar to what I had before. And let's just add a new entry. So I'm actually going to remove this kind of uh, square box. And we're going to add an entry. So I am going to add, let's just say my office that I work at. So Blue Optima, I don't even know the address off by heart. So I've just got to find it. address here I am just going to copy this here just paste that as the description I'm going to add a phone number and just copy this phone number I'm going to add a website The image link, um, 
I'm going to do that a little bit shortly. The call to action, I will just make a call to action to the website. Business type, I say private company. Uh, the business site to the private company. Let's put technology and the surfaces software. And let's put developer productivity. And I need an image link. So I actually use Google Drive. I'm not going to actually do that. What I'm going to do is just copy and paste here. I'm going to copy and paste the previous image link. So now you can see across I have all my data. If I go back to what we have to do next is we have to copy all of this, including the headers, copy all the data, including the headers, and we are going to go back to our map. I don't think we need this. We're going to go back to our map. We are going to overwrite the current date, but we're going to click here and we're just going to paste. As you can see, you can see our data. We're going to click start import. And it takes a minute or two, but it's beginning to import our data. Click finish on port. And what you can actually see is Blue Optima right here. So I click on it, it takes us to Blue Optima. Has the information about Blue Optima. This is a great way to visualize different location based data. What we want to do next is click customize. We can customize the type of in information on display. We can customize the theme so we can create a dark theme. I like that dark theme. We can customize the marker style and change the size. So let's make that a bit smaller. And we can customize the font and the colors. What we want to do next is click publish, publish this map. You can either embed it in the website or use it as a standalone page. If we use it as a standalone page, we can see this is our no code interactive map. Very quick, very simple. This has been perfectly made for the beginner. If you have any questions, concerns, or queries, don't forget to let me know. Feel free to reach out to me on social media or just email me. Happy hacking.